Good morning, everybody, and good morning, tribe. And uh, everybody loves a party, and the rabbits are no exception. Okay. Like a party, yeah. We're going to have a look at Connor um, having his second birthday party in lockdown. So that's really exciting. So that's uh, Maureen, Mary, Sabrina and Lily and Peter's family. So that's that's great. He had a lovely second birthday party. And uh, we're also going to look at um, Daniel, two Daniels, one receiving his prize for the photos that he took and one receiving his prize for the questions he got right. So amazing, two Daniels. and. Uh, and then we're going to have the new questions from Mark chapter 5. Well, in fact, we're going to have them now. So there's two questions I have for you in Mark chapter 5. There's, in fact, there's only two stories in Mark chapter 5. In the first story, Jesus delivers a demon of demons. And where does he cast the demons out into? It's some form, it's an animal. It's an animal. Um, so these animals end up having the demons inside them and then they rush down to the water and they drown. So which type of animal are they? Hmm. Okay, number one. And number two, there's a, um, Jesus is going to, to raise a dead girl up from the dead. It's an absolute miracle. So that's a really good story. But on his way to raise the girl up from the um, official's house, this um, man's house, who does he heal on the way? So, who does he heal and what kind of animal do the demons go into? Thanks very much, guys. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Connor. Happy birthday, birthday to you! you. <laughs> yeah! Connor, tell everyone how old you are. Hello. Two. 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 You're two today. Mm. What's Nanny given you to eat? What's that? We're eating. Crisps! Crispies. I need to show them in. How's the proud grandma? I'm perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Juice, yeah, banana bread, and all of that. Uh, well, it's a lovely party you got, Connor. That's cheated. He can play anything he wants. This way. I've got it. Bang. Bang, bang, bang. <laughs> Daniel, hello Daniel, Enjoy well done Elsa. for those lovely photos, mm -hmm. and what's your puppy's name? Elsa. Ah, as Raywin insists that we film Elsa, and you of course. Yeah. <laughs> Elsa, say hello to Raywin. <laughs> Oh, well done for the photos, yeah. they're really nice. Yeah. I think we'll uh, print them off uh, when we get back to church. Yeah, I went up. on a little trip with my bike um, and I took a little photos and I took um, one of my dog at home. Yeah. Thing from Soft Toy. Lovely. Um, I have it here now if you want to see it. Yeah. Um, have Elsa. Hello. Um, You're wagging your tail. I've got it now. Yeah. Oh, Elsa's so, got a new toy. Yeah, we got it for our birthday, which is three days before mine. Oh. Elsa. And does Elsa not chew it up? Is she quite good? Um. Well, she uses it sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes she's not interesting because yeah. like she has something else to do. Yeah. Yeah, but this is what oh. she normally plays with. Lovely. And um, thank you for the chocolates and the popcorn. That's okay. It's dinosaur popcorn, apple flavoured. So oh. I hope it's okay. <laughs> yeah, I never had it, but hopefully it tastes good. Yes. Yeah, well, you might not have it again if it's not very nice. <laughs> 
Well, give us a wave to the church. Bye, yep. church. Here we are at Daniel's house, and unfortunately, he's not in. So we're leaving his little prize here, his chocolate waffle and his apple dinosaur popcorn. And I'm cycling back in the rain. Now, something very strange has happened to my trousers. Can you see? They've gone foamy. The washing liquid is, uh, has come out of the trousers. <laughs> anyway, strange things. Um, anyway, Daniel, we hope you enjoy your popcorn and your chocolate waffle and get home safely out of the rain. Bye. Answers for Mark chapter four. Answer 1, 41 verses. Answer 2, a simple story used to illustrate a moral or spiritual lesson. Answer 3, the good soil represents a good heart. Answer 1, there are 41 verses in Mark chapter 4. Answer 2, a parable is a short story with an important meaning behind it. Answer 3. The good soul represents those that hear the word of God, receive it, accept and welcome it.